If you want features like portrait mode and stuff, then you might have to stick with me. Why? Because the portrait mode is simply not working over here. So, why did you video in the first video? Why selection remix in portrait work? Oh, brother, it's a mistake. Forgive me, brother. Yes, let's go, let's go, let's go. Now, let's start. Yo, what is up guys, this is Tito back with another video and today in this video I am going to show you how to use Google Camera Portrait Mode mods on your Redmi Note 5 Pro and you don't need magic and you can do it on any other ROM like on even stock MIUI ROM and even custom ROMs which is running on 8.1 so without further delay, let's make it happen and huge thanks to this guy who helped me out with this method and stuff because I was having some problems with some APKs but he suggested me the right APK and the right procedure so here is how to do it first of all you need to go to this MIUI forum which I will link in the description of this video as you can see you have to have unlocked bootloader and rooted with magisk and here magisk is mentioned just because you can edit build.prop with this line if you don't want to flash this zip file but i'm gonna flash this zip so now download this camera to api zip from here and download this apk file which says mgc 5.2 blah 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 final 1.0 what i mean here is download the first one not the second one make sure you download this one because others simply don't work most of the time at least for me so as you can see I have downloaded them. These two files over here are the camera to api zip file which we need to flash with CWRP and the MGC APK file which you can just install normally. Note that guys in latest official resurrection remix ROM you may not need to flash this camera to api zip via TWRP because the latest build already has camera to api in a build. So you can just straight install the MGC camera APK. So I am going to be showing you that I am installing the camera to API zip via TWRP just because I want to show you you can do the same procedure on any other ROMs like even stock leaked MIUI. So now let me boot into TWRP and as you can see I have official TWRP 3.2.1 0 here on my Redmi Note 5 Pro. So now go to wipe, now advanced wipe, now check cache and dalvik, only these two, now just swipe to wipe. Once done, go back, go to install, now locate the camera to API zip file on your storage. Now select the zip file and swipe to confirm flash. Once it says installation complete, just hit reboot system. So I have already done the rebooting and installed the MGC APK. So let me open it up. One more step that you need to follow here is you have to change the camera settings as I show you and after that make sure you full stop the app. In BSG mod settings, you have to select the model as old style, HDR plus parameters set to medium and turn on this portrait mode toggle to always active, final JPG quality HDR plus to 100%. Now go back and turn this save location and camera sounds off if you want that, correction of auto exposure HDR plus set to off. The front camera resolution here is stuck at just 5 megapixels which is really really disappointing when the actual hardware is 20 megapixels but yeah here are some other settings if you wanna see have a close look now if you go back and as you can see you won't find the portrait mode over here now all we have to do is to go to this apps info and just force stop the app Once you have done that, just reopen the app and swipe from the left and boom, as you can see, the portrait mode is here. And yes, you can switch between front and back camera portrait with the toggle switch. And yeah, you can take even HDR plus pictures and slow-mo videos or even stabilize 1080p videos. So here are some pictures that I took with this app. Pause on the one you needed.
So that wraps up this video guys. Thank you so much for watching. If you have enjoyed it and loved my work, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel right here. This is Tito from KDN Tech signing off for today and I will see you in the next one. Bye bye now.